Hey guys, from Pink Game TV here. I'm um, here to show off my OP set OBS settings for my stream, uh, since people have been asking what they are. Um, so, I actually do use OBS, obviously, but uh, under settings, there's only a few things that really change, but I'll go through each tab and kind of go through uh, what I have and why I have that. Uh, here is just, I don't know, there's nothing really here unless, uh, I just haven't enabled cursor over projector so I can actually, you know, do my cursor over and see where... Uh, move things and whatnot. Uh, my encoding settings, I have X264. Uh, I do use CBR and I enable CBR padding. Um, I think those are default checked, but uh, max bit rate, that's going to be uh, probably different for you. But since I'm streaming in 720p, I do 3300 since I have also 6 megabytes upload. Uh, and to calculate your max bit rate, you're basically taking 8% of your max bit rate. But since I'm streaming 720, it means 3300 is fine. So, and 480 will probably be a little lower. I think it's like 2000 around there. But yeah, you can find those settings easily just by Googling. Uh, and then my broadcast settings are pretty standard. Uh, minimize network impact, I have that checked. Um, I think everything else is kind of like you have to do your own self. And then I chose the location that's closest to me since I'm in Colorado. Texas would be the closest. Um, yeah, and I don't really keep recordings. You don't have to keep your recordings. And so Twitch already does that for only a certain amount of days, though. I think that's it for broadcast settings. Then video, this is actually where one of the settings I actually do have that's different. Uh, I have a 1920 by 1080 monitor. Um, my resolution down scale, you can only do it with 720 and 1080p uh, streams, but the down scale is 720. Uh, I do my filter. This is where the setting that basically gets your detail in. It's the, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's the best detail, 36 samples. That's what you want. That's why my streams hide more detail than most. And then uh, 60 FPS is what I run in because I can't stand playing in 30 FPS. So, uh, And I have disabled arrow, which increases uh, my CPU and FPS and all that good stuff. Um, and then, let's see, yes. And then audio, pretty standard. I just boost my mic because it's a bit quiet, and that way I can hear it over the music without, you know, that way the music you can still hear it, but when I talk you'll hear me instead. Um, Hotkeys, I don't really have any. You can mess around with those if you'd like. Um, and here's pretty standard. Not too much. If you need to, you can pause the video here and uh, check all my settings. Um, quick Sync Encoder, I don't use that. Browser, I don't use that. Oh, well, I do use the browser, but not. Those are different settings. Uh, I do use the microphone noise gate, which obviously you can see right here. Basically, anything below this line, it silences. Anything above this line, you can hear. So, only when I'm talking, you can hear me, basically. It's kind of like uh, voice activation, basically. But as you can see, when I stop talking, it basically goes down. But yeah. Um, but yeah, you can mess around, get where you need to get, and then yeah. Um, I think that's it for this video, guys. That's all my settings. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, or anything, uh, suggestions, feedback, feel free to comment down below. Uh, I do read all my comments as, uh, as they come along. But yeah, be sure to check me out on my stream. Uh, all the links to my social stuff and my Twitch is down below in the uh, into the info section on the video. Thanks guys for watching. I do appreciate it. Bye.